Real chicken stunned on these niggas, they all like it, got a damn way to fill up, not the bitch. You know she still let me hit it, fifth to the party, she can't even let me in with it. Pumps off the block, bitch, I'm new with this F and then a cruise off the block, and I'm carrying the game all head of you. Ah, you see the vibes. You see where we at. The last two vlogs started where? Started right here, all right? So you guys already see it, man. We starting another vlog. Today's range day. We going to indoor range, and um, we shooting M4s for sure. They said we were going to be able to shoot M9s as well, but um, I don't really think that's going to happen. But, hey, let's see. We'll see if we shoot the M9s. For sure, for sure, we shooting M4s. Everybody should know what an M4 is, man. It's, this is a Call of Duty channel. It's a Call of Duty channel, so everybody should know what an M4 is. So, um, like I said before in my last vlog, everything's going to be safety precautions. Everybody, Everything's going to be safety uh, procedures. So I'm going to try my best to put the camera in a, in a spot where it doesn't interfere with everything that's going on. This is going to be different from the last place I was at. If you guys don't know, I was stationed in New York before. And in, uh, in New York, we had to shoot with uh, our, our bulletproof vest. They're called LTVs, but just call them bulletproof vests for now. They are our vest, our helmets, fucking gloves. We have to shoot with everything. Here, this is like big boy rules. All we shoot with is eye protection and then ear protection. That's all we shooting with. It's big boy rules, but at the same time, it's all safety stuff, you know? It's a bigger chance of you getting hurt if somebody fucks up because obviously you don't have things to protect you. So I get some good footage for you guys. Hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. We got another army vlog on. You guys are loving it. You guys are killing it. You guys enjoyed the last the last uh, airborne jump. So I'm going to keep bringing it for you guys. Hopefully you guys keep supporting the channel, man. Other than that, it's your boy Tommy, and I'll see you guys later on today. Peace. Down to sleep. Hey, I pray to love my soul to keep. Yeah. 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 Pull up, make all niggas bleed. Yeah. Yeah. I got what I like overseas. What's going on guys? This is your boy Tommy. You guys have a brand new outro. So it's the outro for the vlog. Um I didn't do it yesterday, man. I was I was a little too tired, so I didn't really do it. Um let's close this out. I know I have to do a lot more uh talking segments in the vlogs. These vlogs are more of just segments of whatever the topic is about. 
But um, you guys know, man, I don't really like to talk that much on my first vlog. You know, I did like one or two little talking segments. Other than that, it was just clips and segments of uh, whatever was going on. That's really like how I like to do it because I don't like to sit there and talk and talk and talk and do all this other shit. So sorry if you guys didn't enjoy that because I didn't explain things. I'm about to explain it right now, all right? So what you guys saw the first time when I was shooting, um, it was it's called zeroing. So a lot of people change their sights. So you have the iron sights, obviously, then you throw on like all these different type of scopes. But when you throw on the scope, you have to zero the scope to the iron sight or to the barrel of the weapon. So you basically, it's called, it's basically like calibrating them together and syncing them together. So that's what we were doing. I was using, I was using a CCO um, and we had to sync them together. So wherever I was aiming, that's exactly where my bullet was going, you know? So I zeroed twice because you only get nine rounds, I believe it is. And after your nine rounds, you have to get up and let somebody else go. So my first time zeroing, I, this is what it was. So my, I was shooting up here, but I was hitting down here. So, you know, it kind of came up, came up, came up, came up, came up, did all these little things. You know, I got one or I think four of them right there. So then we started hitting the money around here. So at first we went up and then we went to the right or to the left, whichever way, whatever. And then, um, so that was the first time me zeroing. So the second time I zeroed, this is where we were. So right here, boom, I'm, I'm fucking them up. That's it, I'm fucking them up. You feel me? Came down here, went up, went up, went up. Came a little bit this way, went up, went up. Now I'm in the money, you feel me? So that's what we stayed with. That's what we stayed on, um, for me to qualify. So uh, qualification is the thing that you guys saw. It wasn't me shooting, it was somebody else shooting. Um, the four different positions. So the army has changed its standards. So the uh, the old standards was kneeling, or it was unsupported, supported, and then kneeling. Now the army has changed it to those four standards that you guys saw in the video, which is the unsupported, the the supported, the kneeling supported, and then the standing supported. The old kneeling, there was no board there. It was just you just kneeling with your weapon and you just gotta brace yourself. So um, it has changed it. I shot a 32. My old score was a 36. So I mean, shooting a 32 my first time with the new standard, I'll take it. It is what it is. You feel me? Obviously, I wanted to shoot either the same score I had or a little higher. But it is what it is. You feel me? I mean, whatever. I went back again today and I, um, I re-zeroed my weapon. I confirmed my, my weapon just to make sure that it was actually still Gucci. You feel me? So this is what I did today. Um, one, two, three were my first ones. One, two, three were my second ones. And then I got up because obviously I'm, I'm in the money. But this right here, so whenever you're going up and down, so one, two, three, these went up. So this is breathing. And whenever you go side to side, that's really your trigger squeeze. And then uh, I shot again today. I shot a uh, 26 at first. And then I shot a 32. The 26, I don't know what the fuck happened. And um, the 32, uh, so it's out of 40. Sorry, I didn't say it at the beginning. So you get 40 rounds, four different positions, 10 rounds for every position, and then you have 10 targets. I don't have a target chart to show you guys, but you get 10 targets. So you shoot one bullet in every target in every single position. Um, so you, I shot a 32 out of 40. That was my score for qualifying. All good. My last one was a 36. And... Um, so when I shot today, when I shot my 32, I didn't put my, my hair protection in. So when I tell you I shot my first 10 rounds with no hair protection and you have, there were nine other people shooting. So imagine like you he, your ears are taking in 90 rounds of just, you guys saw how loud, or you guys heard how loud it was in the video. Imagine that in person, 90 rounds. You, you're hearing 90 rounds, it just going off. So my ears are a little banged up. My head is kind of banged up. So after like my first 10 and I was like, I, after I shot my first 10, I put my hair protection in. I was like, nah, bro, I got to get off this range. I was like, I'm, I'm done. Like my, my ears were blasting. Like I thought they were about to start bleeding. So I was like, yeah, I got to get up off this shit. But uh, that's it. I hopefully you guys did enjoy this video, man. If you guys did enjoy the video, don't forget to like, 
comment, and subscribe. If you guys are new and um, you guys think I should have did more talking segments, leave the feedback down in the description below. Leave the feedback down in the comment section below. Other than that, I've been taking too much of y'all time. It's your boy Tommy and I'm out.